Guys, it's Marco Editi, and I'm gonna bring you After Effects best render settings possible for any After Effects. These are the best, fastest way to um, render your edits, videos, and anything you want. Alright, so what you wanna do first, go to File, and then you wanna go Import. And then you wanna click anyone, I'll just click that one. Alright, so just drag it into the composition over there. Leave, oh, sorry, my bad. Yeah, so leave it there. Whoops, 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 yeah, there you go. Uh, so there, and you want to go there where it says 8 um, BPC, click that. Make sure you change that to 16 BPC per channel, press OK. Next thing you want to do is go hold down shift on your keyboard or keypad, whatever, and then go to After Effects, Preferences, and General. Make sure you keep holding it down shift until um, you get this thing here and then you can let go. If it doesn't, you need, because... You need to hold down shift to get this cigarette thing, because if you don't hold down shift and it's not there, it didn't work, so try it again. Alright, so you want to make sure this disabled layer is clicked, and the one down on below is clicked as well. Make sure it is every two frames during make movie, so make that to two. Then click OK. Next thing you want to do is just like, oh sorry, next thing you want to do is remember your um, FPS up here, 59.876. Just remember that because it'll come in handy later. Alright, so next thing you want to do is just like, you know, edit it, do what you want, you know, I don't know, whatever you do. Alright, so I'm just going to shorten it down because I don't want the render taking too long. So I'm just going to bring it down to uh, here. So about there. Okay, so that's where I want it because I don't want it rendering that long and taking forever. So then you want to go now is composition and then you go add to render queue. First thing you want to do is go to out. Output to click leftovers and then make it test and then save it on your desktop or in a file or something. Next thing you want to do is go to output module, click that. Instead of format QuickTime, change it to um, H.264. All right, and then you want to go include up here, so click that. All right, next thing you want to do is go format, go go to profile, leave that as high. Leave the level as 5.1 and then change the bit rate to 8. Alright, so that you don't need to do anything else on that page and click OK. Come down to audio, click audio. Leave this as it is and stereo and then go to format. You can just play around with it if you've got, you know, audio and stuff. You can play around with it, make it better settings and stuff. But I don't want to do that because I don't need to. And then click OK. Next thing you want to do is you want to go to render settings. Click that. Leave it on best. And then you want to leave the resolution as full. Alright. So if it's not, change them to both. Next thing you want to do is go to frame rate. So this is what I was talking to you before up here about the FPS. Alright. So you want to click the use comps frame rate. Um, comps is another way for computers. Even though if some of you don't know. Um, so use the computer's frame rate. Make sure that's clicked up there. Um, you don't need anything in custom. And then click OK. Now what you want to do is the most important thing to make a faster render settings, you want to go caps lock and then start the render. Alright, so it should be rendering out. It takes up to about, I don't know, five minutes. Depends how long the video is. If yours takes forever, it's because your video is heaps long and um, the render settings on your computer is not up to um, what it is here. If it isn't, go through back through the video again and watch it. Alright, so I'm just going to let this render out. It should be about... I know if under five minutes up here where my thing is, it should it should get up to five here or just under five. So one, two, three, four, five. Um, it says sixteen minutes here, and yours should say sixteen, seventeen minutes, whatever. But it's actually like underneath that. It's like five minutes, four minutes. So um, once it's done, I'm gonna come back to you and yeah. So I'm just gonna pause the video and then I'll come back. All right, guys. So I'm back and it's finished. Um, doing the render setting thing. So now I come to my desktop and here it is right here. Test. Double click on it. And here it is here. And I'm just I'm gonna show you how it looks and how it's pretty smooth. I watched it before but here it is. Nice work. Get ready. Yep and that's it there and because it's all these blacks off here it's because I cut it short there. Um, during the settings um, when I showed you before but yours will probably be the full length of it 
So that's it guys, I hope this has helped you a lot, um, that's the best render settings that I can show you, I hope it's helped you a lot, um, please comment, like, subscribe, if you have any troubles and it's not working, please tell me, I'm happy to help, I'll do this whole thing again if you want me to, um, yep, so just comment below if you need any help, um, and alright, I'm out.